Hello guys, Dan here and welcome to some more naval action. And guess what? I'm back with the Navy Brig. Get in. Nice one lads. Nice one, nice one. And another nice one. Yeah. I've never been more happy to get another ship. Because <laughs> that um that privateer was doing my head in. But it turns out that when I'm not recording, I'm actually a lot better at this game, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got this in about two or three battles in the privateer off uh, when I was off off camera. So yeah, it was uh, not too bad, I suppose. Yeah, I'm glad to have this finally. And it is a really good looking ship. I think it's the uh, the paint on it that makes it makes it look all good. Yeah, it's a sexy beast. Very nice. Alright, so there's two navy brigs, a privateer, a lynx, and a cutter on our team versus a snow, two privateers, and a brig. So, um, it's going to be a good fight. It's funny how small the snow is, really. I mean, it's not. Well, it's not tiny, but I mean, I think it's the sails that make it look tiny. It's got tiny little masts. <laughs> and that brig's... The brig looks massive. But yeah, my aim for this uh, this game is to... stick with my teammates. And not get separated. So, how are you guys doing? I, um, I put my naval... Well, not my naval action, my uh, War Thunder. First war thunder, vi first war thunder video up earlier today. I hope you guys have uh, managed to have a look at that. Let me know what you think. I'm actually playing that again got me really back into it. I'm actually looking forward to perhaps doing some more videos of it because it is a fun game. <laughs> kind of feel like we just left our our weaker teammates just to get on with it. We're just gonna we're just gonna cruise along. Oh, I'm thinking of doing a um another flight simulator video tomorrow, and perhaps a full flight type thing in the Airbus Aerosoft X. Airbus A320, perhaps. I don't know how long the flight's going to be, but I want to at least get the takeoff and landing, and then the setup as well, the the aircraft setup, and how I do it, <laughs> which is probably not the professional way of doing it, but how I do it at least. And um, yeah, do some like cinematic type shots in between. Maybe put some music over it. Because at the moment I'm just I'm just using Windows Movie Maker which is obviously not the best video editing software when you compare it to things like Sony Vegas which I w would quite like to get but I wanna I really wanna know that people enjoy my video appreciate my videos and things like they you know really like them and that uh, that last was it my first my first or second privateer video I got some really good comments on there you know just asking me about things and that really, you know, that kind of gave me a big boost, if you if you like. So it made me think that all oh, these these guys actually are interested in my videos, isn't it? So I'll um, I'll do some more. That's what it's all about. Getting your guys' feedback and uh, trying to hit ships as well. That's what it's all about too. Oh, that's my friend. Yeah, see, I'm not concentrating, I'm just shooting at my friends for some reason. Now he's shooting at me. <laughs> is, that, is he actually hitting me as well? <laughs> he actually hit me that time, bastard. I don't think I hit him. Right, what have we got? 
these guys moving as a, a bit of a group. I'm gonna follow this guy. See if we can hit the air snow. Yeah, I didn't go flying today, unfortunately. The weather was pretty terrible. Up where we were going to go. We're going we were going to go to Welsh Pool. Which is in Wales, funny enough. He took literally zero damage. Let's go gunnery mode. Get some faster reloads. I'm just looking at the brig and seeing what the actual differences are. So I think in terms of the hull, there's not much going on besides the addition of, a gu of two more cannons. I think they're in this area here. The new, the two new ones. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Let's see if we can hit him with our arse cannons. <laughs> One hit lads, that'll do. Right, let's fire our right hand side into him if we can before he turns around. There you go, that'll do. Then uh, we'll go for this guy. The snow. Yeah, I look forward to getting the snow back because it is a nice. You just feel powerful in it, like the biggest ship in the light battles, at least. Because you have PvP light and PvP, and PvP light is for light ships only. So you can't have like you couldn't come in here in a surprise, for example. Lovely. Let's go double. Yeah, you can come into this game in a surprise. The bigger ship is the snow you can have in here. I don't know if you can use a Cerberus in here. I haven't seen the Cerberus. Yeah, he's getting some good shots off now. Bastard. He's turning towards us to, I guess, use his other side of cannons. Good man, good man. See if we can just shoot him with our ass cannons quickly. Oh, lovely. Right in the side. So we've, all, we've lost the cannon on this side, or looks a bit. Oh! Nasty piece of work. And give just as good as I get, mate. Let's do one repair. Go and survive because we've clearly got we've got a leak above the waterline, but we're taking on water a little bit. Oh, that was a very good hit. If these two crash, that could be a good thing. Because <laughs> if he loses his, uh, I need to find out what that thing's called. The uh, the nose. If he lost that, that would be rather helpful. Point blank range. He's definitely look at he's definitely taking on some water. You can see those cannons are getting close to the water. <laughs> oh, you bastard! 
we go, Jimmy. Yeah, he's, he's not he's not finished yet. Got nice proper naval battles here, just sailing along and broadsiding the hell out of each other. I would load double in my right hand side, but I don't want to have to reload them all. I've already got balls in there. <laughs> Giggity. Sure, he's gonna miss us. Thank God. Let's get double loaded up in there, and let's go. We're gonna have to do a repair, aren't we? Because that right, that. Left hand side is ruined, and our right hand side is not going to be far off at this rate. You fishy bugger. <laughs> don't, know, don't know where fishy came from, but I said it anyway. Oh, you bastard. Love it. See how I'm turning the sails there to give me a better turn rate. Right? It's very important. Sales are on auto. Um, let's go back to gunnery because we've uh, repaired our hull enough right now to um, hopefully prevent leakage. We've got one repair left. I think that's really important. Oh, great, now my arse is ruined. I have to use my last repair, aren't I? That's a really important part of the game, though, is to try and keep repairs. Because I've used them all. I'm going to have to use them all. Like I just did. Annoyingly. I see no one's dead yet. Oh, did he just... Did he, he's just gone. Yes. We're one up now. Pain will shortly follow. Can I hit him from here? I'm going to say no. But his guns can't hit me. Oh, they can actually. They, they definitely, definitely can. Can I hit him though, is the question. Yes, yes I can. Oh, you little shit. I hate being shot at. So just... It sounds horrible, feels horrible, and it ruins your life. It makes you want to slice your testes off, and then boil them in a pot, in a bowl of soup. <laughs> I haven't a clue what I just said. Ignore it, I'm tired. <laughs> just ignore me. Just watch the boat. I have nothing important to say anymore. This is one of the things I'm starting to learn is that you can it's you know, you run out of things to say sometimes. I could just shut up right now, I've got <laughs> I'm just blabbering on for no reason. I've got to just try and talk about the game, haven't I? Right. Bug crusher. I'm gonna crush you like a bug. You just wait, sir, for my wrath. Oh, don't do that. Well, that went well. That, that was great. Let's go over here and try and save the Prince of Wales. Where's our Vanavia Brig? 
He's over there. Playing with none other than a privateer. Are you, are you kidding me, sir? How's he? Oh, he's quite quite healthy now. I'm quite quite worried about going over there and fighting him. But I'm trying I need to stay into wind because if I head over to where he is I'm gonna end up going into wind. I don't want to do that. You fuck off mate. I'm gonna have you Jimbo. This is not going to go well, but hey, I wonder how many repairs he's got left, what do you reckon? Yeah, and he's got rear cannons too, hasn't he, so he's got the benefit here. There you go, and that, there's your, your back cannons. Yeah, running away is now ringing in my head. Run now, because my front and back are nearly dead, and he's going to be shooting at both of them soon enough. Let's try and get some something off. We're taking on water. We're not going to hit him. Let's make him come to us. This is the plan. Oh yeah, he's not having a good day. He's going to be dead soon enough. Oh, the Prince of Wales is down. Prince of Wales down, lads! Oh, let's try and get around here quickly. And get some point blank double shot off into the side of our matey boy over here. Whilst trying to avoid being shot at by the almighty snow. Come here you bastard. The time's up friend. You can't look, he's not he's lost no health. This is ridiculous. You having a laugh? God's sake, man. Well, yeah, I hope you're enjoying the Navy Brig. All of its nine cannons of... Wow, yeah, we are absolutely fucked. And this is what happens when, uh... When, um, you know... You go into the game and get absolutely fucked over. I'm not sure if I did anything wrong. I mean, I tried to stick with the team. We got separated somehow. I'm not, I can't. I have to watch this back, and he's outmaneuvering me big time now. He's also into wind, like me. Oh, would you get lost, mate? Oh, I swear to God. No survival because we're going to sink any minute. If you look down here now, you'll see that I'm going to enter a negative figure, and that's where you need to turn the opposite way. So, like right now, see, I'm going left rudder, and that's going to carry on bringing me around. if you watch and then as it begins to climb up again which it will inevitably just watch, we'll start to climb up now-ish there you go and as it gets into the positives let it get a, let it get a bit into, don't do it as soon as it gets in there because otherwise you might go back to negative right and now turn and there you go, that's how, that's how you turn if you're into wind So 
some wind in my sails would be great right now. I just want to shoot at the teammate, you know. Really do. Oh yeah, he's taking damage now. Whoopty bloody do. Let's type in good game. BG, bad game. <laughs> That's the title of this video. BG. <laughs> bad game, bad game. Stop shooting at me! God's sake, man. I'm sinking. Get over it. Yay. Ugh. I should have stuck to my original plan of no more videos for a while of naval action. That wasn't too bad. I mean, I'm sure my damage is going to be atrocious yet again. What a beautiful sight. For that last video, I was going to show you my desktop, but I didn't. So here we go. Here we go, Ford one car. Big fan. Right. So on my desktop, we've got Train Simulator, Euro Truck. We've got Farmer Simulator 15 and 13. Uh, plus Flight Simulator 9. Uh, F1 2014. Um, Modern Warcraft, don't ask me to play that, not a big fan of it. Um, Cold Space Program, and that's it, most of these besides Farming Simulator, I think, oh and F1 2014, they're all um, off of, oh Star Citizen, yeah I forgot that, and World of Warplanes. But, but all the other ones, they're just uh, shortcuts of my Steam games. Star Citizen, I haven't played that in ages, and I don't know if it's really a a videoable game, if you like. That it's not something you're going to have seen before, because if you were interested in watching Star Citizen videos, you've probably already seen the walk-arounds of all the ships. And I don't have... I've only got two ships. So I don't think I'll really offer you much in that area, but once the game goes into like an open-world state, like it's going to be eventually... Oh, well, um... I shall... Do, a video, do some videos of that if you like because I'm quite looking forward to that, that's what got me to buy it in the first place it was the open world bit and just how cool the ships were, like. you could actually walk around the interiors of them and things, just awesome uh, World of Warplanes, yeah I don't mind doing some videos of that I need to get back into it anyway, I'm actually part of a team I haven't played with them for like, ages, like over a year just because See, World of Warplanes is the kind of game that when they do a big update, they reset everyone because they think it's unfair when the people join, which I think is absolutely bullshit. Because if you think about it, let's take I play GTA 5 all the time, right? And I've got a lot of money on it, and nice apartments, nice cars, and things. But there's new people playing the game all the time who are like level one. I'm level 127. Deal with it. You've joined the game late. You're going to have to start from the beginning. We all had to start there at some point. And you're always going to have other people who are level 1 to play with. Like, um... Let's go back here. <laughs> like, um... Same with World of Warplanes. There's, a, there's always tier 1 games to play in. And they're actually really fun, by the way. I love playing tier 1 games. Um... Because after you've played the game for a long time, you just go in there and just destroy noobs. <laughs> um... But yeah, there's always tier 1 games, and it pissed me off so much, because I got a tier 8 uh, German fighter. Um, that took me 8, I spent like all summer getting there, and then, big update, and they put you back to zero. And I played it for a little bit, and then just thought, you know what, I can't be asked. Even with the new tech trees, like the British tech tree and that. I'm just like, nah, I can't be bothered. And you've got to pay for new aeroplane slots, which you didn't have to do before. Just, I just, no, I'm not having it. But War Thunder, on the other hand, keeps you where you are every time it does an update. So in my in my mind, War Thunder is another better game. Although there is a, a really nice arcadey funness to World of uh, Warplanes, which well, which War Thunder doesn't have. It's got a more serious tone to it, but still, 
I must say I do prefer it. Oh, there we go. That's damage. Oh, I did. I got the most damage for our team, <laughs> even though I felt like I did the shittiest. So there's, there's. The, look at look at their team though. He's whooping ass. That snow. He opened a can of whoop ass on me. But yeah, we are slowly but surely not getting any closer to the snow. <laughs> um. But seriously, guys, let me know in the comments. Say, oh, Dan, do some more videos of the Navy Brig or the Brig. Or any, you know, anything from here down I can do a video of. If you want to see that, let me know. Because right now, I don't really feel like playing much more naval action until um, I can get the snow in my own time. And then do some more videos. And then I'll do a lot on the Cerberus, just because that is an entirely new ship for me. The Navy Brig's just the same as the Brig route with an extra two cannons and a new paint job. But the Cerberus will be good. And then obviously I'll be back into surprise and almost getting the Trincomalee. Look we how close we are now. Like, oh, I just I might just mm, Yeah, I was thinking, I was just gonna say I could probably get it tomorrow to be fair. If I just played a lot, I could get the Trincomalee I reckon. So I might try and do that. Because that that could be an awesome video if I do that. Um, but yeah, I think that covers everything. My little rant about resetting things and that, and obviously the video itself, which I hope you enjoyed. Even though yet again it was another terrible battle, I just hope you're finding it funny, or you actually like watching me fail. Either way, I just hope you're enjoying the video. I'm not thinking, oh god, this guy's shit at this game. Stop filming it. But if you did it that way, let me know. Tell me these things. Um, yes, yeah, so I can. I can be the best YouTuber I can be. Which I really want to be a good YouTuber. I want to be a funny YouTuber who plays cool games. So yeah, just suggest anything to me, and I'll have a look at it and see what I can do. But yeah, thank you very much, guys, for watching. I've been your host, Dan. I hope you've enjoyed it. I shall catch you tomorrow in the next one, or, hang on, later today, in the next one. <laughs> See you guys later.